Hey guys, she's Emma here. Welcome to what is a trackable newbie tips. So this is the second episode. I know I realised I haven't done many of these, or not many at all. So I thought I'd do. I have a notebook of all my ideas. So this is the first one. So I, I thought I'll describe to you what a trackable is. So I have some examples here of different types and what they look like. So this is part one of a trackable. Because I'm going to do another one, which is how to activate it and how to discover it and how to find them, etc. So this is part of my collection, a very small part, but here is a lackey coin, so so all the lackey from Geocaching HQ, and so if you don't know what Geocaching is, pop up to that card right there, and it would say what is Geocaching, newbie tips number one, so here's all the lackeys, right here, and this is the 2018 one, so here's that, you can discover it, so it's HQVYGW, so I'll have a little code right there, um, that's one, that's one type of it, so they're all different sh uh, shapes. But they, if it's a trackable, it should say on it somewhere, trackable at geocaching.com, so they, that's how you know it's trackable. Um, this is another one, what I've got recently from GAGB, which if you don't know, it's the Geocaching Association of Great Britain, so it basically helps geocaching all around the UK, so if you don't know, they're running a trackable race at the moment, so they've got four types, a pointer, which is, have to get loads of discovery logs, and there's three other types, so I think, I forgot the amount, I think they're £5, I'll let you know the amount and the link in the description below, so if you want to discover this, you're more than welcome to, it's GBVGDD, and also 50% of the sales go to the UK Mega, and if you don't know what a Mega is, I'll also um, leave a link into the description below. And that's it basically, well not really, but, um, so this is what a trackable tag is, so that's a tag because it's got like a chain on it, and this is called a geo coin because it's just different, I think it's because it's like 3D I guess. So they're, these are two different types, so I have lots of um, geo caching coins and tags from various places. And also recently I've got these cool cards, so if you still don't know what geocaching is from my uh, newbie tips video, um, scan this QR code, so screenshot it and um, just screenshot it basically, and it says on the back what it describes there, so I'm not sure if it's back to front on there, but scan that QR code if you don't know what it is and it should take you to the place where it explains what geocaching is, and it says geocaching is part of a worldwide support sport dedicated to GPS users called GPS treasure hunting or geocaching. So that's another thing that I'm going to put into geocaching so I think it's quite a sweet idea to let other people know what geocaching is because so if you know anyone that doesn't know about geocaching but you think they're interested just give them one of these so they're from all cashed up so I might get them, might buy some more and sell them my shop or whatever I'll see what they did with it so it's quite cool so I'm going to leave all the links in the bo uh, description below um, this is newbie tips. What is a trackable? And I th think that's all right. Basically, about what is a trackable. So what you do with them? Sorry, I've just remembered. Um, you find one of these in caches, or some people may have them if they're in their personal connection if, uh, collection. If they don't want to move them around because they're quite personal, or they're quite rare. What you do is you find the or find this or this in a cache, and you write down the trackable number, and you can either discover it, which means you see it but you don't take it, which um, most people will do if it's in their personal um, collection. Or if it's in a cache and you want to take it out, um, you just uh, write down the trackable code, go on trackable.com, so I'll probably do another video on how to log it, and it should say retrieve, so you would retrieve it. So you take it out of the cache, um, then you put it into another cache. So the difference between this and the swag is swag, you get to keep. So like the stuff in toys which aren't trackable you get to keep and trackables you should not keep at all because the trackable owner won't be very happy but you just move it along from cash to cash or some trackables have a mission so they might be like oh travel around the world or stay within Britain so make sure to check the mission before you take it just in case you take it to the other side of the world and you doesn't need to or doesn't want to so this is the end of the video here and catch you later